What's good, y'all? Today we talking about the P A post out of the gum bunch. We uh we just gonna go random play because uh everybody knows the P A post. So I'm gonna show y'all how I run it. I like to streak the running back. I like to streak the tight end. I like to keep a, uh B on a slant or a drag, so I motion hike him. Then I like to pit the best thing, that, the things that make this play. What the heck? The thing that makes this play so good to me is like when I pit my running back on the out. This is this is what makes the play because y'all know how in corner strike that flat or whatever zone is over there has to choose between the C route and the running back. It's basically the same thing, and a lot of people run PA post and they leave their running back blocking. And if they just put a purple up over there and just watch or man up A and guard B, then they basically lock it down. But the only way to stop this uh, setup is if they have a flat and a purple to that side. They have to man up the post. Then they have to watch B themselves. Now, I know a lot of people won't think to do that, especially if you're mixing up your plays. Like, you see you're running random plays. And boom, he comes down to the running back. We're going to throw it there. So your first read is going to be uh, B because that's a quick read. Or B or Y is going to be your first read. Your main read is going to be A or X. Like, that's going to be the big chunk yard. I don't know what they're running. But if you motion that out, usually a man, that motion slant or motion drag, it destroys man. But I'm not saying to use this mainly against man coverage. I'm saying, like, if you're uh, actually using every play right, like, y'all see how it just opens up that uh, lane for Martavius Bryant because of that post over the middle. And that's why I tell people, like, I like to – uh. Boom, we come out here. Now they're man. I saw their man, so I go to the C route or the post route. Like, you really have three routes that can beat man on this play. You got the C route, you got the post route, and you got the slant. Uh, but, and this is what makes this play so good because these routes can also beat any zone. Like, you see, uh, dang, I threw it up on back foot. But you see how they come down. They played the C route on that play. I'm going to show you all. So, like, all you, yeah, like, bro, the, but the running back's only running out the backfield, like, for a yard. But, like, look. If I just do that right here, like, that, that corner is playing the C route. That's the easy 10 yards for uh, Le'Veon Bell. I just threw it off my back foot. But this is why I think this, what makes this play so deadly for me because then they start shading underneath because that halfback route could make you, that could, like, really make somebody mad. Like, you see, they're playing up there. I throw it to here. That's an easy 10 yards. And as soon as they start shading underneath, I can throw it to the C route. A lot of people like to hit this post route, but I like to use this C route in this, uh, running back route, and I like to use the slant. I I rarely ever throw it to the post. Like if anybody ever plays me, like if he goes to play that post, then we're just gonna throw it to the slant. It's really a read you want to make. Uh, you could put this guy on a drag. You could really do what you want. You could. And another setup I like to do with this, I like to put RB on an out, and put uh, B on a fade, and then put X on a slant. Because then once people start getting used to your setup, you want to beat zone to the other side. So you got there, boom. No one's in a flat over there. You can throw it to him, or you can wait for the post to go over the middle because then with this setup, this setup right here, uh, when you streak him and put X there, you're forcing him to either play the sidelines to the right or you're forcing him to play uh, this running back, the slant, or the post route. So you, you're making him choose, like, you're making him choose, like, what to do. So they go there, and then all I do, boom, I got X right there. It's literally you, you, just you making a read. But my main setup, I only do that once they start getting used to this setup. But the main setup, this is the main setup. You just want to, it's basically like corner strike with, with a post over the middle. And that's why I love it so much. You see, they're chasing a the post, and I have Martavius Bryant under. I just didn't make the read. But I hope y'all enjoyed this. Let me know if y'all got any questions. But until then, it's your boy, J Mail